Hey y'all, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. My name is Shamika with all of Shamika and I'm back with another video. If this is your very first time clicking on the video of mine, then welcome to my channel. If you are not new and you're one of my older but goodies, hey love, hey boo. I am back to let you all know what is new in my Etsy shop, what has been in my Etsy shop for months now. I really don't have any changes besides bringing you all, all the, the new stuff. It's not too much, but I also want to just let y'all know some stuff that i'm going to be adding to the shop that's going to be like heavily discounted um because i still have them they were pre-made and so i want to offer them at a super like low extremely discount so that for those that are interested in starting their cash budget you don't have to go spend an excessive amount on like you know expensive envelopes you can just get some try it out and then once you're good and you know how to do it and you're ready then you can um you know make the purchase for more envelopes but anything i list <clears throat> excuse me anything that i talk about today is going to be listed down below so let's get right into it so up first as you all know i do sell the budget binders um these house your cash envelopes with for me i do have quite a few different binders that i use personally and so i wanted to just show you all the three that i have right in front of me so when you go on the shop you're gonna see options for the two puffs or the crown i do not offer the bubble gum anymore i may have like two or three already printed that i will be willing to sell if you just leave me a note and ask me before you make the purchase i do have these some of these already cut out um so i can just throw it onto the binder for you but i I will not offer any in the future because this was difficult um the hair was extremely difficult the curls were pulling and it was just too much so i do not offer the bubble gum but like i said i do have a couple left so if you are interested leave me a comment before it like message me on sc i reply right back and um let you all know if i have any available but you are able to customize the front of your binder with a max of three words because anything more than that makes the binder super um like bulky or not it makes the words like really extra these right here are two of my most popular fonts really the sharpie pen like everybody does sharpie pen pretty much everybody i that orders loves the sharpie pen and then this was the lovely blooms that i really really like so those are that or actually this might be an old font because this one's lovely bloom i think this might be kind of old so i don't think i offer this font anymore but here's a similar one and then if you tell me like oh shamika i just want script only um just give me like in the a description of where you want it at when i think script only i'm gonna just put it down at the bottom or if you want it up here or top you just kind of got to give me like an explanation of where you want it and how you want it to look and then i will verify with you if i'm a little confused about your order but for me when i think script only this is what i'm talking about you don't have anything else on it no doll no name or anything just a script so i really like this because it's super like um you know really minimal not a lot going on really not decorated like the other two so that is what these are those are the binders and i don't have just these colors i have blue pink purple yellow green black red and then i also have orange so i'm just now trying out with orange and kind of seeing how it works i do not offer any other color vinyl except black on the binders obviously on the black binder i'm gonna give you white vinyl but as far as like throwing any other colors on there i won't change the color of it it's gonna be black a black doll font name everything else so that is still in the shop those are still available moving on to our envelopes that are still in there and <clears throat> this is what they look like you get the option i thought that i thought i cut these but you get the option to have the white border envelopes with the heart at the bottom if you choose you don't want the heart just simply tell me no heart i don't want the heart and then with the font on the inside you can change the font to whichever font you would like again i told y'all sharpie pen is one of my most popular ones but you do have the option to change the font there and then these are actually all of my white and then i do change i will change the uh, vinyl on this for you so if you want pink um silver white black red 
I do have a few different colors of vinyl that you can choose from. You don't have to use white or uh, silver. So here's the silver color. And that's what that looks like. Let me see if there's one without money. Here's one, our passports. So that's what it looks like. So you do have the option to change that if you would like to. So that's that. And then up next, we have our other envelopes that have the dolls on the front of them. Oh, something else I want to um, mention. When you get on there, you do have the option, like I said, to say, Shamika, I don't want no border. I don't want the heart. I just want plain going across uh, vinyl. And this is a script only vinyl envelope. So these should be listed in the shop as well. So that's what it will mean by just a script only vinyl. No decoration, no nothing. Here is the Sharpie pen. And then here is the Lovely Blooms, which is my favorite font. But this is just like a crowd favorite. And then moving on to our 52 week savings challenges and our penny challenges. This one is a hot seller right now. Something that I came up with and just created when I wanted to house my penny and my 52 week challenges because I do those every year. But I separate them on a quarterly basis. So January through March, April through June, July through September, and October to December. And then I also offer when you, whenever you buy a penny or a 52 week, I give you a tracker that has it broken down by month because when I do my challenges I send the money monthly I can't do it by like a week or by a day I sat here and I totaled everything up from January to December how much it would have cost to send to the penny challenge each month and then same thing with the 52 week now with these <clears throat> these are a little bit more customizable you have the dark pink as an option you have the light pink as an option or is this the same color girl that's the same color I'll grab a dark pink um, here in a second. But you have a darker pink than that one. You have tan. I can do it in white. And I want to say those are the only three colors. So you have tan, white, dark pink, and light pink. And so, so this is how the light pink looks. It's a little bit lighter than the other one. So you can kind of see the difference when you say light pink. This is the color that you're going to get. And again, you are able to customize this way more because... It's me just printing it. Um, and so you can do, I will leave all the dolls right here. So you have the option to change the dolls out. I will not change the font because it's already pre-made. So the only thing you can customize is the color and the doll. And so this is where if you want that bubblegum girl, go ahead and get your bubblegum. And it is a clear backing. So that is what is in the shop. And that's what those look like. And obviously they're a, a, um, a six size. After those, we have our doll envelopes that I wanted to kind of just switch up a little bit. They're not vinyl. They are vellum. And you also have the option to change the doll and the color. So if you didn't want black, you can do yellow or orange. Probably orange because yellow won't show up. Um, black, blue. I pretty much do any color you want um, listed in the shop. So if you want fade, you can mix it up and order them. These are so individually. So you have to buy them individually. But those are also listed in the shop as well. And I love these. And then here are some brown ones. This just has my daughter's name on it. I will not change the font only because it just works for the dolls being that font and the doll right there. It just makes sense and it works. If you choose that you don't want the doll and you just want script only, here are options of what the script only looks like. Of course, I wasn't going to put dolls on my son's envelopes. So for his haircuts and allowance, and you can see that it's brown. So if you got like a blue binder or purple binder, um, you can change the color of that. So that is that. Those are all on the shop. Those are some of my older ones. I want to start with the old and then end it off with the new stuff, girl. And then these were just options of how the faith look with the 52 week and the penny. So that's that. And then we had some of our oldie but goodie envelopes. So this was like um, 
envelopes that I used in my file effects a few years ago or a few months ago and so I just alternate between envelopes so I like to keep my envelopes in that wallet I just like to keep them in there and then when I'm switching wallets out you know I'll just keep the same envelopes but these were so cute they were so cute and I just love the pattern so I actually have an entire box right here of envelopes that were already like packaged up so we had some marble and those were like the blue marble and you'll see these listed in the shop also these are going to be a dollar per envelope and they're already packaged up so they're ready to ship like as soon as you order them and you are able to add labels to them and you just have to leave them in the um in the description when you order it so i got blue marble and then i have I don't know what that is <laughs> and then i have like another assorted amount as well and then just a bunch of like little envelopes that look just like these very simple and especially if you are new to budgeting you want to start off with something like this and i will give you a label and you are able to choose your fonts um font, op font options on there so we got some purple and then just more different more fonts on our more um designs and then we have our pink marble in the bag and we have our purple marble and all of that so these are available they are like i said a dollar envelope so some of them are a four pack some are a five pack and i want to say i probably have like one or two six packs so if you are interested in those those will be in the shop also but I want to get to the new stuff. All the new, new. This is y'all really got on here for it. <laughs> Girl, I went and decided to make a... Oh, before I get into that, I do want to let you know that I don't have one in front of me. Because for some reason, I can't find my envelopes that I had. But my zipper doll envelopes, I do have a a7 and an a6 size i'm gonna leave both of them on the screen they look similar to this except the doll is on the left and the words are on the right but i do sell them in a7 and a6 size i've had those around for months now and they do really well in the shop but i had a customer reach out to me and she wanted to wanted it in a7 she gave me a chance i excelled at the chance and so now they're like a crowd favorite in the shop so make sure you check for those but i do have them in both a6 and a7 so those are in the shop as well but these right here are my new ones these are the girl what size is this oh this is a7 so these are the a7 size envelopes that i created the vellum and i love these so on this you can customize the doll you are able to customize the doll and you're able to do whether you want white or vellum the font i will not change right now unless someone wants me to like play around with their order but for now i won't change the font um because i see that it works and again if you've been if you're not new to my channel then you know that i like to try it on myself first before trying it out for others so that's what this is if you want the color change i can change the color pretty much similar to the other envelopes these right here similar to these envelopes where i can change the color on them so if you want the color change and everything i definitely can do that i just haven't had anybody order it like that yet um so yes you have the option to do that and i will hole punch them if you want me to hole punch them i also will round the corners for you as well so you can tell they're not sharp so those are my envelopes and i love these these will fit comfortably in a moterm size wallet which is where these go depending on the size wallet that you have these will definitely fit really comfortable in there and i'm trying to get them in there for you so you can see they fit really comfortable they're not too big and they're like the perfect size and they fit a good amount of money i have been using these but for me um i have another size so those are if you order i'm gonna have them separated between small a7 and the more larger a7 which are these right here and i just made these like last night and this is going to go in my pink budgets wallet because her budget is a little bigger 
on the bigger side than most and so that's what these are looking like and honey when i tell you i love them uh because they are like a big size i love these i'm also gonna round the corners you do have the option to change the um to change the border color the vinyl i will have customizable border colors i will not change the font on these because it works and um i will let you change the color though and then obviously the font or the um title what you want it to say but these are more on the bigger side they're about or I'll leave the dimensions on the screen, but this is what it looks like when you have the money in there and they are, they are perfect. I love these. So these are my own personal ones. If you do not want the border, simply just let me know. Shamika, no border. I'll have that option on there where you want no border or a border, but they're going to come just like this. You just going to have to ensure you, um, let me know what color vinyl you would like. And then I do have the zipper envelopes. These are still on the shop. So when you see the ones that say script only, this is what it's going to look like. Um, I think I have. Or yeah, so this is what it's going to look like if you just say script only, no border or anything. That's what it's going to be. So that is everything um, that I have that I can actually like physically show you. The next thing I'm going to discuss is going to be the budget binder sets. I am going to have them like floating through the screen right now. This is for my budgeters that are new to budgeting and you don't want to spend a whole lot of money on it. But you do want to have something cute to get you started. This has been a crowd favorite since I released it. Um, it comes with an entire budget kit. So you get a binder. You get six zipper envelopes. I do not put any dolls on it. I will let you decorate the front whether you want the binder, the doll, or just script only. But on the inside, it's going to come with six envelopes. Just words on them. No font changes. You um, No color change on the the uh, font also but it's just gonna come that way you're also gonna get a 52 week and a penny challenge your choice of the doll you're also going to receive a money envelope um for the bank a money bank a bank teller envelope that you can take to the bank and have them um give you the money back in you're also going to receive a the penny and the 52 week uh, breakdown. And then all of this is going to be the exact color. So if you want yellow binder, everything else is going to match. It's going to be yellow. If you want a blue binder, it's all going to be blue. So that is another one to um, check out in my shop as well. Those do really, really good. And I love making them and sending them out to you all. So that is everything. Um, I hope this video was informational. I hope it was helpful for you. As I go through, hopefully I've left the um, the dimensions. If not, everything will be linked down below. Everything will be down below in the description. My shop name will be down below in the description as well. But I wanted to just come and update you in 2022 of what's in the shop, what's new, what's there, what's not there, you know, stuff like that. So thank you all so, 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 so much for watching. If you, um, if you have questions, please don't hesitate to let me know. Um, I'm very open. I will answer questions. If you message me on Etsy or YouTube or Instagram, just reach out. Girl, that's all you got to do. My Instagram name is the same as this one right here. And I do have a social creations, uh, website as well, or, um, Instagram as well. So yeah, thank you all so much for watching and happy shopping. Hope to see you all in the shop. If not, see y'all in another video. Bye.